Today we're going to be moving some lights out of the way because this ceiling has to come down. I'm going to replace that with a singular light bulb just to have light in the room. And these lights have to come down as well too. Which means I'm going to have to cut off the electricity and terminate those circuits so I can work there safely. So we're going to be doing that next. And I'm going to show you step by step in real time as I do it if you're a beginner DIYer who wants to take on a more serious home renovation project. Grab some pliers here. We're going to either straighten this down or just crimp it down nice and tight. As you see there, now we can screw on our nut. So you're going to take a wire nut like this and it just screws on like a normal screw. Just tighten her down and you want enough wire in there to give it enough bite. This way we have everything capped off and insulated away from touching anything because we're going to pack this back inside the box there. Get some electrical tape and we'll go ahead and close it off. Now I can go ahead and handle the neutral side. There we go. Now we have our light socket that we can install on the other one. So because this is going to be a live circuit once again, we're just going to practice safety and go ahead and nut this one off like so. We pack this back into the box for safety. Now there's no way that it can cross over and touch anything it shouldn't touch. So I'm going to pack it kind of in such a way where the hot is not going to be touching anything metal, just kind of hang in there. And the neutral is packed up out of the way and they don't have a, the possibility of crossing over and shorting. Now let's go ahead, we're going to go back into the living room and take down the chandelier and install that guy there. Okay, so here's what I'm doing here. So I'm just making sure that this is not cocked or glued onto here because normally these are just press fitted and screwed on. Here is the screw bit right here that's holding this thing up. So let's go ahead, we're going to take this off, hot wire out of the way. Even if it's dead, you just want to make sure you don't touch it, don't touch anything else unnecessarily. Take her down. Screwed in threaded rod here, and there's a nut back there that holds it in place. So you just want to hold that nut in place and just unscrew this. Just screws back on, and just save it with your chandelier to reuse it and hang it back up. Get your wire strippers, and you're going to strip off about that much copper wire, open and bare. Take a little hook, loop it around, and you're going to just tighten this down, and that's it. And then you screw this back up and put your bulb in. And straighten out your wire as best you can. And you just make a loop. Just like that. See? And then it goes around your nut. And you just tighten your nut down to it. And you do the same on this wire. It's denoted by a darker color on the uh, positive side here. You just hook it around the uh, length of the screw, the thread of the screw. Give this a little tighten down on your loop. Just to give it a little more contactivity. And just tighten this down. And that's it. And you repeat on the other side.